Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I don't think I'm surviving. Oh no! Oh! Oh! Rexer here and welcome back to some more killer in purple 2 now guys we're gonna be coming back with one of the most entertaining videos i think i've probably ever done i love this game so that being said i had to come up with something a little more creative to bring you guys now i don't know if you're here because you love killer in purple 2 i don't know if you're here because you love the channel and i don't know if you're here because you just love fnaf or maybe it's the fact that i'm just extremely handsome Okay. Whatever reason you're here. <laughs> I'm glad that you're here and I just want to thank every single one of you guys. The channel has been growing absolutely insane. We've gotten more likes than I can ever imagine. We've gotten more views than I can ever imagine. And all of the new subscribers, I just want to say thank you guys for being here. All the old subscribers, thank you guys for being here. It really, really means a lot. So, that being said, my video plan today is to play obviously Killer in Purple. But number two, I want to make like a pretty decent sized pizzeria with like a maze running through it with tables and have foxy like attacking and it's a whole thing uh i'm talking like a million foxies guys my plan is to have like 50 million kajillion bajillion foxies all around and then we're just gonna put a little maze and try to survive i we'll see how it goes it might be a total bust but let's go ahead and jump in because we got a lot of work to do to our pizzeria now the best part about it is i kind of took some time to design a giant building. We got some money, 37,000 37, um, coins. Now we need to design the actual pizzeria. So the plan is we need to set up the maze first. <laughs> Obviously it's a maze that we are designing so it's not gonna be too hard, but let's see. We're gonna go with the tables first. I gotta move my mouse over a little bit and we're just gonna set it up literally from the door on. So here we go. And we're just gonna have this go like this. We could probably turn it here. And do you guys understand what I'm saying here? We're gonna have, okay, wait, it can't go like that. We're gonna have to block off this cause that's gonna get in the way. We're gonna make it, uh, to be honest, I have no actual structure for this maze. None at all. We're, <laughs> we're kind of winging it with how it's gonna actually look. But the cool thing is that's gonna, uh, it's gonna pay dividends cause when we start playing the game, we're not gonna know where to go. Which is kind of good. It's going to make it challenging for us, which, you know, I love a good challenge. And I've never really designed a maze before, so this could be the most absolute terrible maze I've ever possibly designed. But it could also be the best possible maze you guys have ever seen. So we're just going to leave it at that. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I'm not like a labyrinth, a labyrinth wall maker. But what is the word I'm looking for here? Yeah, Jesus, I... I I'm at a loss for words, but we're gonna bring this back. You know what? We, we have the maze going in one direction, and you know what? It can't it, it can't be going into the wall, bro! Turn your maze! Okay, here we go. What? 45 degree angle? Would that be useful? I don't think so. Let's just make it go this way, and then back in. I'm gonna end up cheating. I already know it. I'm gonna end up cheating, and you know what I'm gonna do, guys? I'm gonna end up jumping up on these tables. That's just how it is gonna be. I'm gonna be running, I'm gonna freak out, and I'm gonna jump on these tables. And the craziest part is, we need to finish this Oh wait, it's already 17, so that's already 5 o'clock, that's 5 o'clock, right? So it's gonna get dark soon, it really doesn't matter though, does it? Yeah, no, nah, it doesn't matter. To be honest, I don't even think this is a maze, it's kind of like a fortress more than anything. That's what we've built here, we've just built a fortress. I, don't, I, I mean, this is, it's solid, it looks pretty decent. It's not the best maze I've ever done, but it's also not the worst, seeing as it's the very first maze I've ever done. Okay, we need entrances for the foxies to get in, so we'll probably put a little entrance here. And then, can I block this off? Yeah, we need to block that off. Yeah, we're blocking that off. That's the entrance to get in. Wait a second, can the foxies even... I guess that's the whole point of a maze, right? It's the... You're supposed to get stuck eventually. Alright, so that's our first dead end. Here's gonna be our next entrance for the foxaroos. We're gonna go ahead and put this music is changing it's getting dreary it's getting dark will we survive find out in the next episode of rexter's maze from the pits of heck is that a good name would you guys consider that a decent name i think it's not bad <laughs> might have a little series on our hands if anyone wants to develop that game mexter's 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 rexter's pit of heck 
Uh, I might be your guy, all right? I'll do the voice acting for it. <laughs> all right, let's bring it this way a little bit. Let's, I can't see. We gotta put the flashlight on, bro. It's getting dark in here. Darker by the minute. I, I think this is a decent setup. To be quite honest, guys, uh, mazes aren't supposed to be perfect. Look, see, that one's gonna run into the wall. I'm gonna run out of money. I hope I have enough to buy these animatronics. I probably should have done that first. Hmm. That's all right, we'll figure out the money situation later. Let's set up this maze and not worry about that right now. Holy moly, well we got this half kind of done. It doesn't look bad. Um, I'm gonna allow myself three jumps. To be honest guys, I have to, because I don't even know if this is a structural maze that will make sense. I don't even know if you can escape this actual maze. Right now we've just kind of thrown a bunch of tables together, so I don't even know if there's an actual exit to it. So, that being said guys, bear with me. We're gonna spend this, I mean, we're spending a good amount of money on just the tables alone. Oh, see, that's perfect. That's the perfect maze design. If I've ever seen a good maze, it's one that just leads to a dead end. Ooh, wow, now we're talking, guys. Now we're talking. I'm slowly getting my architectural skills uh, to the level that they need to be for my full potential of, uh, of 9,000 power. It's over 9,000! What, 9,000? There's no way that could be right, could it? I, th I think this looks good. Okay, I mean, the maze itself is now complete, guys. It looks pretty good. Uh, I mean, for a beginner maze designer. So now the next step is going to be adding all the foxies. And that's where things gonna, you know, that's where the money kind of comes into play. And hopefully we figure out a way to make some money. <laughs> or we could just have GFC maybe help us with a file. I don't know, we'll figure it out. So I need to hit Q again. There we go. We're gonna add a stage, literally all the way around this puppy. I mean, this stage is gonna be big because guys, there's gonna be a million foxies running around at top speed. Uh, 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 here we go. And yeah, and the reason I'm picking Foxy guys, I mean, if it's not obvious already, Foxy's the fastest character in the game, right? Right around, oh, nice, we got a little corner stage. Nice, nice, very good, very good. Anyways, Foxy's the fastest character in the game, right? So the most challenge you're gonna get is from running from a bajillion Foxies. And I'm literally, guys, I'm not kidding you when I say this. We're putting Foxies on every corner of this place. We're putting them all over the place. When it hits five o'clock, you better forget about it. We're dead. We're dead. <laughs> I don't know why I'm not hopeful at all about this, but no, that's our entrance. So there can't be a Foxy there. Uh, we'll throw one more stage here. That looks good. And then along this back wall as well. And probably the wall over there. Bro. This is gonna be a challenge for sure. Here we go. Here we go. All the way down, baby. Okay, what? Yeah, I should probably do it like this, right? I, I could easily just keep walking with it. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Okay. Nice. Beautiful. Can we turn it? Can we turn it? Yes, thank you. That's fine, we got a little space in between the wall, but it's fine. You know, at this stage, honestly, at this point, it's not even even. But I just don't feel like wasting my time anymore. There's definitely not the... I've seen better stages, for sure, but hey. You know, this this will do. Okay, so now the fun part comes in, ladies and gentlemen, where we add the foxies, at least as many as we can, which is two, for now. Dang it! I wish it was unlimited. Alright, it's actually less than two, so... I gotta figure out a way to get some money, and we'll be right back. It is complete, ladies and gentlemen. I have finally done it. As you take a look around the entire building, except for right here, because <laughs> I ran out of money, there is a bajillion foxy animatronics ready to kill us at uh, 12, 12 a.m., I think, is when we're gonna start having them attack. Yeah, so, basically at 12 a.m., my job is to survive all of these crazy maniac animatronics. So, let's get this party started, guys. So, guys, we'll fast forward all the way through. Uh, yeah, I kind of ran out of money, guys. This costs a lot. If, in case you're wondering, this costs, like, a lot of money, obviously. We need to put our flashlight on as well. And, um, yeah, it's basically how long we can survive. <laughs> if we die, we're going to have to start over. But, uh, hopefully we don't. Hopefully, you know, best case scenario survive all the way so here we go we got it's go time all right these foxies all activate at different times well 
Foxy, the animatronic itself, activates at a different time. Now, Freddy starts a little sooner. Bro, they can't go through tables, right? Can they go through tables? Probably should have thought about that. Anyways, we're gonna deal with that later. But they're gonna start attacking any minute now. Okay, you know what? You guys are taking too long. Freddy's gonna show up for the- Oh, 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 oh my god! <laughs> Wait. Okay, sorry. Cheating. I'm cheating a little bit. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I mean, it's the only way we're gonna actually survive. Jumping over the tables. New rule, guys. Jumping over the tables counts. You still gotta look around you at all times because there's- Holy. The rest of them haven't even spawned in yet, bro. This is crazy. Okay. Ah, they're coming. Ooh. I'm stuck. I was, I'm too big to go through. I'm too small. Whatever. I don't know. Okay. Run this way. Holy. Oh. Okay. They're all, look how many of them. Bro, look at this. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> Jump the table. Get back. Oh, it's so crazy. They all move in unison. What the heck? Ah. <laughs> Guys, this is nutty. This is nutty. Hello. Can you jump over this table? You can't. Oh my god, there's not even a table there! I thought there was a table there. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Hey! Right. Okay. Uh I can't jump over. Yeah, I can jump over this one. We're still safe here. I wanna get over to Oh my god. Uh okay, they're coming really fast. Okay. Let's they're already cutting me off. Oh my god, I don't know if we're gonna survive this night. I don't know if we're gonna be able to survive. We have plenty of time left. It's not even 3 a.m. yet. Oh my gosh. Uh, look, when they don't turn either, you can't see their... Oh no. Oh no. Where's the Freddies? Bro, the Freddies... What are you guys doing? The Freddies aren't even attacking. Oh, okay. If they go that way... This gives me some... Oh, okay. What? What are you guys doing? Why are they just... <laughs> okay, whatever. We're gonna let them do that. It's 3 a.m. now. Whoa, there was some behind us. I had no idea. Okay, this is bad. This is real bad. This is real bad. This is real bad. I need to get... Bro, Freddy? What are you guys doing? Uh, I'm probably causing big problems for myself here. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, that one's a straggler. Why is he behind? Why is he behind everybody else? Oh, no! I don't know if, is is Foxy actually faster than Purple Guy? Like default or or am I faster than all of them? I really don't know and I don't want to test it out just yet cuz we're about to survive. We're about to finish the first night with these crazy maniacs. I don't even know the only way to make this harder obviously this is like the stage one Foxy. I didn't bring I didn't put any around here yet. It's just on the outer side and the left and partially on the right cuz we ran out of money and Freddy just decided he wants to play you now. So here we go. Keep running. Keep running. Now we got the whole big open spot to ourselves. So, like an hour and a half of survival by ourselves. Uh, this might be a bad idea. This might have been a bad idea. I mean, running from Freddy wouldn't have been a problem. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't think I'm surviving. Oh, no. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Jump over the table! Get out! Oh my god! We riled them all up! They're all together! Oh my god, bro, that is insane! <laughs> oh! I can't believe we made it! I felt like a surfer going through the middle of a wave! Holy moly! Run for your life! We're almost done, right? We're gonna survive. We got less than an hour. So what? There's always one straggler. You guys you always gotta watch for that one straggler, bro. Get out, get out. <laughs> this is a great idea, bro. This is an absolutely insane idea. I'm so glad we did it. Oh. What happened to the music? The music got so intense, I guess it cut off. How are they all gonna go back to the stage? Look, they're using the maze perfectly. Now they're confused. Now they're all confused. Like, what?
Well, we survived, right? I mean, hey, not too bad. We did a decent job of surviving. See, that's the thing that I like about this game, guys. No matter what, you can customize, you can create, you can do a whole bunch of different things that just you don't really get in other games. Like, what other game other than like Minecraft maybe or something like that could you create this in crazy, like crazy entire environment and just have like a zombies mode with Foxy? Absolutely awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have more ideas for me, by all means, guys, let me know in the comments down below. Also, if you like this video, you want to see more like it, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. So I'm going to wrap up here. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will see you guys in the next one. Until then, peace out!